Well, we have what's surely going to be a thrilling game in store for you today. The hype has been building all week and the fans are pouring into the stadium. The anticipation is palpable. Warm welcome from Stamford Bridge. My name's Guy Mowbray and alongside me is Sue Smith for commentary and a live game from the Premier League on the way. It's Chelsea versus Manchester City. Thanks, Guy. Well, I'm really looking forward to this one today. It'll be interesting to see how both teams line up. But what an atmosphere we have here. I absolutely can't wait. A chance to cross here. And that's where it ends with possession lost. And the ball has gone out, goal kick to come. Well, Kevin De Bruyne is one of the absolute best at what he does. What are we expecting to see from him today, Sue? Yeah, and he's such a talented striker of the ball. He hits it so cleanly, manages to get so much pace and fizz. It's always going to trouble the goalkeeper. The defenders just can't give him a yard of space today. Here's how Chelsea line up. Wesley Fofana starts alongside Trevor Chalabar as the centre-backs and the man tasked with leading the line is Christopher Nkunku. This is the Manchester City starting eleven. Edison is between the posts. Ruben Diaz starts alongside Manuel Kanji in the centre of defence. Rodri plays alongside Kevin De Bruyne in central midfield and the main man in attack is Erling Haaland. Able to skip past his man. And the cross comes in. Well, that's how to clear it. A good advantage played by the ref. Kevin De Bruyne. Foden. Oh, that's been won really smartly. Chelsea showing good width here. Kukurea. Out of play for a throw and maybe just a lapse in concentration. Mikhailo Mudrik. Chalabar. Gallagher. He takes it on. Well, he's kept that out nicely. Delivered into the box. And Kunku having to stay patient here. And it just didn't happen for them. Yosko Gvardio. De Bruyne. Lovely weighted pass. And it's there. They have a goal. And they have the lead. Well, here's the replay, and it's a nice through ball to split the defence. And what a finish. He goes for power. It was never in doubt. He just looks so confident running through. Chelsea get the ball moving again. Can they get themselves together for a quick reply? Raheem Sterling. A chance to deliver into the box. Cuts inside. Sterling! Still a chance off the keeper.
Erling Haaland. Rodri. Foden. Can he finish? Well, not the easiest of saves, but you'd expect him to probably stop that. That's a corner. Maybe the chance to get their noses even further in front. comes and the shot thwarted there's a chance for them to go now James cross deep towards the back post well watched by the goalkeeper read the flight nicely needs the composure now another goal and it's one that tightens their grip on this game well we can see it again now and they're so dangerous in these transitions the speed of the counter-attack is really impressive and then through on goal, he decides to go for power. Absolutely smashes it past the keeper. And you have to say it was a good finish. And we're back underway at 2-0. Mikhailo Mudrik. Mark Kukurea. Wesley Fofana. Chalobah. No need to stop the play. On they go. And Kunku. Could get it over now. And that's nicely won to see off the threat. Pass that results in a throw in. A little unlucky. Mikhailo Mudrik. Sterling. Sterling. It's in. Oh, they needed that. And they're not out of this game yet. Well, we can have another look at this. It's a brilliant strike. He makes great contact with the ball. And the goalkeeper just watches it fly past him. Chelsea are still trailing here, but that's a goal that's given them fresh hope. Good vision to switch the play. Doku. Fantastic looking ball. And we're looking at the clock moving towards half time now, and Manchester City hold the lead. Yeah, this has been a decent half in terms of attacking display, created some good chances, played with a real intensity and a confidence about them, but conceding will have really frustrated the manager, I'm sure. Sterling. They could level it here. Huge block, but still danger. And the threat has gone with the keeper in control. Jeremy Doku. Erling Haaland. On to Gallagher. Wesley Fofana. City being afforded too much space here. What a chance here. It's in. And of course it's in. It's a masterclass in finishing to complete his hat-trick. Well, here we can see it again. Sometimes when you're through 1v1, it's easy to be caught in two minds. He was just really composed and the keeper had no chance. Brings the first half to 
a close here in West London. Well, there's no doubt that Erling Haaland has played a starring role in the game up to now. What have you made of him, Sue? Well, that's an outstanding first-half performance. His goals have been really well taken, but it's his all-round game. His movement, his work rate. Wonder how many he's going to get today. And the ball rolling again, with Chelsea facing a lot of hard work in the next 45 minutes. Chelsea finding space on the flank. Good looking ball played in, and not the best of deliveries. Walker. Now De Bruyne. Haaland. And that's not a bad save at all. Been delivered. Well, that's how to clear it. Put into the middle. And it's popped up and over the crossbar. De Bruyne in behind. Can he finish? Terrific. Another goal. What a scoreline this is for them. Well, here we can see it again. And a simple finish it may be. But it's all about the movement in the box. Just to find that yard or two of space. That's what makes it an easy finish in the end. The game gets going again, with Manchester City starting to run away with this. De Bruyne, found nicely and in. Well, I'm sure he thought he'd scored there. Great goalkeeping. Phil Foden. That's out of play. It'll be a throw now. Foden. De Bruyne. What a chance. Oh, what a goal. That is truly special. That's a quite incredible hit. Well, looking at the replay, this is a really good initial save. You've got to feel sorry for him that the ball falls to an opponent. I'm not sure he could have done much more, to be honest. So the score now 5-1 as we restart once more. Mark Kukurea. 
Well read to gain possession. Wesley Fofana. Mark Kukurea. On to Fofana. Trouble, maybe. They're allowing space, and he's finding it. He'll take this on. But the keeper saw it coming and saves easily. James. Chalabar. Kukurea. Fernandez. City have it back now. There's a chance for the breakaway here. Haaland. Found nicely and in. And this is turning into one magnificent and memorable match. Yet another goal. Well, here's the replay. And it's so impressive how quickly they go from back to front. And as soon as he's through 1v1 with the goalkeeper, he just goes for power and smashes it in the net. It's a quality finish. Wesley Fofana. He's beaten his marker here. Kukurea. Well, it did look promising, but threat averted. City with acres of space to attack. Now, this has to be. Oh, what a save! Well, he's a class goalkeeper and he showed it there with that save. Raheem Sterling. Chalabar. The ball with James now. City have possession again. Good patient build-up, but not quite the end product. Gallagher, Sterling, and it's on now, and it's a pretty good save by the keeper. And here it comes. And a really good bit of goalkeeping to keep out the headed attempt. And the pass is incomplete. Nicely won. Good run. Now, can he pick out the right option? Doesn't want to lose it now. Chill well. And that's where it ends, with possession lost. So the end is in sight. What are your thoughts on the performance we've seen here? Yeah, they thoroughly deserve the victory. The attack in play will get all of the plaudits, and rightly so. I've been so impressed with how well they've kept the ball. The work rate's been excellent. They win it back quickly when they lose it. Just been a good all-round performance. Good work to beat the challenge. Oh, what a really good save that was. Kovacic. Sterling, Gallagher, a 
A goal that brings only ironic cheers from their supporters. It's all too late. Here's the switch, nice ball. Well, there's the final whistle, and it's Manchester City who take the three points. Well, that was a dominant performance. They just couldn't live with him from an attacking perspective. Created lots of opportunities and some good finishes too. It was actually easy in the end.